Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Man Time. I'm back down here at the Confused Waterway. And this is uh, kind of where it comes together and flows around this area here. You saw in the uh, the last episode, the O2O was running kind of uh, kind of weird. It was sputtering and stopping sometimes and acting like uh, it was... I don't know. I, I think I've got it narrowed down to either uh, lack of spark or too much gas. Um, cleaned out the air filter, messed around with the carb, and now I'm going to put it through its paces here and see if um, it, it, that same scenario doesn't arise again or if it uh, ha has gone away. I don't know if I've got the carb adjusted right or if the spark is becoming intermittent. Um, the, the spark didn't look all that good. When I went through it the first time, it was kind of a weak spark, and it's got, you know, the electronic, um, looks like a rotary type of electronic spark in there. Um, but I've got it sharpened, and I've got it ready to go. So today I'm going to be going through the woods here, taking out some of these trees, and I'm going to try using the O2O 2 for it. It's about a 30cc saw from uh, maybe the 70s sometime, and uh, I've got a lot of trees here up this path where I'm cutting the uh, cutting the path for the waterway. So we'll try the 020. If that doesn't work, we'll switch over to the 031. And yeah, that uh, that's the plan for today. So stick around. Welcome to man time.
we got a tree that fell into the back cut here. Let's see if we can drive a wedge in there and maybe get it going the right way. Yeah, it's uh, it's leaning back pretty good. I don't know if this is gonna work or not. If I had wedged it a little bit lower, I probably could have some leverage to push it over, but I don't know. Yeah, it's leaned back pretty hard. And lean back in another tree. Maybe I can use this vine to pull it over. Let's try that. Gotta improvise, think outside the box here. Use all the skills we have in the toolbox. Oh. I think that might work using this vine. It moving pretty good there. I think uh, I think this vine is the answer. I have just got to. Uh, Get enough leverage here to be able to use it to pull this tree over. There we go. <laughs> oh, this is great stuff. Couldn't make this stuff up, right? Well, one good thing, one good thing about it, I guess you could say, is the uh, the holding wood was good for the size of the tree. Uh, nice wedge in the front. Uh, back cut was good. About an inch of uh, of holding wood. There wasn't enough there to uh, get a wedge in there anyway. I just, I guess, misjudged the tree. Luckily enough, there was the vine in there. <laughs> felt a little like Tarzan trying to get this tree to come down finally found uh, enough leverage there using that that stump from the first tree uh, or the tree before this one um, to bring it down so I guess that's why we watch uh, YouTube and not uh, some dumb sitcoms and stuff you couldn't script this type of stuff but uh, O2O is running good and uh, a lot more trees to cut down so stick around and uh, thanks for joining me on man time
talk about a good workout get out into the woods run a chainsaw for about four or five hours run some heavy equipment I am one whipped little pup and uh, I, I saw myself um, the last couple trees there just getting super tired uh, super winded and uh, not making the best decisions right so that's that's when you know it's time to quit and uh, and hang it up for the day so that's where I'm at but I enjoyed every minute of it and after I get some lunch and uh, slash dinner <laughs> and uh, relax for a little bit take a shower uh, I I'm gonna feel like a million bucks it's uh, it happens every time you get out here you do the work and then you can look back and say man I I accomplished so much today and it's a really good feeling. Uh, you, you can see up the path, um, you know, I've got it for the most part cleared out. I've got a good line of sight from the top of that hill over to the top of that hill. And that's a, this is the first time that, that I've had that. So I'm making some really good progress here and I'm really happy about it. But uh, yeah, thanks for joining me today on Man Time, guys. Get out there, throw some chips on yourself, get dirty, get your feet all muddy, get grease up under your fingernails, work hard, sweat a lot. Have fun and have you some man time. Thanks for joining me.